Everybody knows what volume is. When you want to jam out your car, you turn up the volume. Oh, it's so loud. Oh, I can feel my ears. Oh. Even though the volume is really loud, you can still hear the drums over everything. The reason the drums are louder than the rest of the song is because of what we call dynamics. They have a higher amplitude than the rest of the track, and that is the subject of today's episode. This is EDM Tech. Most of the time when you record audio, the waveform isn't flat. There are peaks and valleys of the audio. This is what we call amplitude. Amplitude is a measurement of how tall the waveform is at a given time. You can see in this recording that when I talk very quiet, or when I talk very loud, the amplitude changes. The waveform is a great visual representation of the sound you're working with. The waveform represents how the speaker is going to move. We're going to demonstrate with this speaker. The waveform moves the speaker up and down. Higher amplitudes push the speaker more, which creates a louder volume. When a sound has varied amplitude, it's considered more dynamic. Here we have a snare drum. The way it's played in this recording is very dynamic. The peaks, as you see, are near the ceiling, and it tails off to near silence. That gives this sound a full dynamic range. Next up, we have a bass guitar. The way it was played in this recording gives it a medium dynamic range. The peaks don't go all the way to the ceiling, and the valleys don't go all the way to the floor. It stays within a medium range. This power drill is pretty much flat on the waveform. It doesn't have very much dynamic range at all. You almost can't even see the peaks, which gives this sound a low dynamic range. Low dynamic range! Here's two different waveforms for two songs. One is more dynamic than the other. Can you tell which one? That's right. It's more dynamic because it's got negative space. It's not always at full volume. This space is important because it gives the speakers a break. It lets you clearly define the louder elements of a song versus the quiet parts. The other song is way less dynamic. The audio doesn't drop down so the volume stays the same throughout the whole track. A common misconception is that louder is better. If you want to look more into this, look up the loudness war. So that's dynamics. On the next episode, we're going to talk about effects that control dynamics. <laughs>